In a world where danger lurks around your house, around every corner, five people come together to tell you about these items. They're not guns, knives, or chemicals. They're batteries. Yes, they are useful, but they can be dangerous. Watch what happens when you take a 9 volt battery and simply touch it to a piece of steel wool. 9 volt batteries are especially dangerous because two terminals are close together. When the battery touches the steel wool, the strands of the steel wool complete the circuit, causing it to catch fire. Let's watch that again. Imagine this is happening in your junk drawer or trash can. Even weak batteries can have enough charge to left to start a fire. The best thing to do is to store batteries in their original packaging, and before throwing them away, put the caps back on the batteries. If the battery didn't come with the caps, or if you lost them, you can stick a piece of electrical, masking, or duct tape over the terminals. This can prevent a circuit from being formed. Throwing away batteries is not the best choice. When batteries reach the landfill, the acid can leak out into the groundwater and can cause contamination. Rechargeable batteries contain heavy metal elements that allow them to be recharged over and over. These heavy metals are especially dangerous to the environment. Even though alkaline batteries are safer, they still take up a lot of brown and landfills, especially since they are the most commonly used type of batteries. So, what should we do with used batteries? Recycling is the best option. You can help the environment by participating in our battery recycling drive. Just bring in used batteries to school and place them in the recycling field. We are also going to have a contest between Central, Lakewood, and Nangers Heights Elementaries to see who can collect the most batteries. Don't forget to put a piece of tape over the posts of a 9-volt battery.